Ladies and gentlemen, this is it. We've come far, but we've had our ups and downs. Our fair share of losing, victory, destruction. Triumph, failure, loss. It's all led to here, to the Elite Four. This could be either the fastest, the, the shortest, or the longest episode. It could, we could be here for about 10 minutes and lose to Aaron immediately, or we could be here for hours, for two hours, and actually beat Cynthia. Hopefully, that is the goal. Let's just fucking do this. We have everything planned. We have everything planned. I've even put Chin in front. And a few things I should quickly go over. The only, I think the only change at the moment is obviously the levels I grinded off camera. They're not 65 like I said they would be, but they're close enough. We're not, we're not super over leveled, but I don't think we're going to be under leveled for anything either. Abs did learn, I forgot to burn him, burn him, shit. I forgot to burn him. Hmm. Okay, we, let's just go. Let's just do this. The main four Pokemon that we're going to be using is Chin, Mustache, Spoon and Bark. The first one is Chin, we're going to set up Swords Dance and hopefully sweep with... Oh, they changed it. He doesn't have to log anymore. Well, that's unfortunate. Uh oh. Here we go. It begins. This is it. We're in. We're in it now. Five Pokemon. All bug type. A Dustox. He leads with a dust ox of all things. We're, we're fine. Unless he has ghost. In which case we might be in trouble. 53. We are sorted. Now remember I judged my level cap on Cynthia's final Pokemon. And gave us about a 5 level gap. Light screen. That does special moves. But we've just sword stands to physical. We should be able to just flame wheel our way through this. That's one. Level 53. A Heracross, we can take this. Heracross, honestly, is actually quite scary. It's pretty strong. Thankfully, we outspeed and we should be able to one-shot it. Yes. I think it, it's, it's the Drappy on that I'm worried about. Beautifly. I thought he had a Vespaquin. I don't think he had the two, like, Eternal Forest bugs. Aaron is nowhere near as strong as I thought he was. We might need to use two Pokemon for Bertha. I'm already thinking ahead because we've basically already won this battle because we've got two Pokemon left. He does have, Vef have Vespaquin. He has Vespaquin. <laughs> no, he has Vespaquin. Cr 
critical hit, that's fine. Really being able to set up a sword stance immediately is very helpful. And the light screen wore off, we didn't need to worry about that anyway. There's the Drapion. Will this one shot now? I'm not sure. He's actually faster, that's gonna hurt. Whew, okay, yeah. That just goes to show the power of the Elite Four. First Pokemon League victory doesn't come easy. Oh, this is a difficult situation. He might go for Earth... I think he goes for Earthquake again. What I could do here is send in Mustache and finish him off with Waterfall. I did not expect to have to do this, but I'm playing it safe. I can't remember what Drapion's abilities are. I don't know if it gets dry skin. I think... I know it gets Sniper. One of them is Sniper, but I can't remember if that's a hidden ability or not. Yep, there's the Earthquake. 57. That is a fast Pokemon. Jesus. It goes for Cross Poison. Okay. Ow, that does a lot of damage. Because it's a critical hit. Okay, it doesn't have dry skin. Good. The first battle is a win. Good to know. First battle is a win. One down. That's one. And now we we heal just to make sure. And I'm not sure who to send in next. I think we I think we'll do mustache first. I think we'll send in mustache first to scout what she has. Actually, I'm not sure. Can we actually get away with just going straight away into Bark? Maybe we can. Maybe we can get away with it. I don't... I'm not confident, but I think we can. Hello, Bertha, my old enemy. <sighs> that line haunts my head. Will you show this old lady how much you've learned? <sighs> that line haunts me. What did she have? Quagsire is the other one she has. Okay, we can take this. We can definitely one-shot this with the with Grass Knot. We genuinely might be able to sweep a team with Grass Knot. Are we faster though? Yeah, we are. And that was a one-shot, excellent, right. We might be able to do this easily. We can save the blizzards for Garchomp. Sudowoodle? What? Sudowoodle's really slow, unless it has some sort of priority move, maybe Sucker Punch. It could go for Sucker Punch, I'm not sure. Yeah, but nope, it doesn't. We're good. This is kill. It doesn't. It might have a head smash, it might have head smash. I think he's going for head smash. That could kill. Head smash. It does. Oh, we're in trouble now. And it has rock head. Hmm. That's bad. I'm not, I don't know what Sudorudo's special defense is. I'm tempted to go into Spoon, but I'm really not sure. Actually, I think his special defense isn't that good. Ah, uh, what if it has Sucker Punch? 
We could definitely lose right here, actually. No. It dies. Good. I think we still take hail damage, though. Yeah, we do. Whiskash. Ah, shit. Whiskash is special, isn't it? Like a special defense Pokemon. I think we can take it with Mustache. We generally might have to finish this entire battle with just Mustache at this point. Okay. Hopefully this kills. It's not going to kill. It does half health. Does it flinch? Hydro Plum. That won't kill, surely. Yeah, that won't take out a Gyarados. We, take, we both take heal damage. But we are faster than this Whiskash. And we finish it off. Excellent. Hell stopped, good. Golem. It probably has sturdy. Probably. I don't know what to do. I think Abs is actually the right move. I really do think that Abs is the right move. I'm not confident. But this is my only way of thinking. Hits twice in a row. I don't think that's going to be enough. And I, yeah, I feel like we have to take this out with physical moves because we can't use, we can't use Alakazam for this. Target hit, hit twice in a row. That can break the sturdy and we can finish it with an earthquake. But I don't know what it's going for. Yeah. Yep, earthquake. That does half health. Ooh, he's going for another earthquake. We could definitely intimidate it and hurt it. It's not in sturdy anymore. It has rock polish. Right, it might be faster now. Maybe actually Hmm, maybe not, because Golem is really slow. No, it's faster, and it has Stone Edge. Okay, that's good. We take it. And it dies, thank god. Right. I think we heal. I'm gonna heal here, actually. It powered on. Yes. Yes, I'm going to switch. I'm going to switch and I'm going to heal.
because we can intimidate and then we can double intimidate. It's definitely going for some sort of. It's definitely going to go for some sort of rock move. And there's the sand stream. That's something we're trying. I definitely thought both the lead with this, to be honest. Hyper portion. Ah, I didn't think of pseudo wudo. I didn't think that had. Ice Fang. Okay. It has Ice Fang. Why does it have Ice Fang? Is there like Stone Edge or something? I think this is why I should have bought Max Portions in full restores. That's a second Intimidate, so whatever it does. There, Ice Fang again. We take Sandstorm damage. If we set up... Okay, I'm going for it. I'm going for Waterfall. Flinch. Critical hit. No flinch. Crunch. Okay. <laughs> you have like no health. What are you talking about? Full restore, you bitch. Wait. Wait, we win. Yeah, we just win anyway. We take sandstorm damage, but we win. If it has protect. Okay, we've won. Oh, okay. We lost. We lost Bark. That's not good. But we do have Spoon still. Spoon will 100% outspeed Garchomp. 100%. Right, this is not good, actually. This isn't good. I'm just going to make sure everyone's at full health. All right. Mustache is going to have to put in even more work now. Because we're going up against the fire type. Elite 4 member now. Definitely should, ha should have a full fire type team, but I'm not sure if he will. Oh, then Flint. Okay, what we do here, we rain dance. We rain dance, we get boosted fire type moves. Ah, one of them's gonna definitely gonna have drought though. Rapidash, that's a fast Pokemon. But I'm not sure about how hard it hits. Plus we get an intimidate off as well. Rain dance. Hypnosis, what? What? Hypnosis? You're joking. Oh, God. Um. Awakening. Just wake it up. This thing has hypnosis. Poison jab. Okay. Oh. Rain dance. Let me rain dance. Fuck off. <laughs> <laughs> Why?
We just we just have to hope that it misses one. It's a fucking bastard, man. How do we? How can we slow this down? If it poisons us, we should be all right. Yes! Oh my god, it poisoned us. It actually did. It actually poisoned us. It can't put us to sleep. Why? Why, Gyarados? Why? The fucking friendship actually might have fucked us over, though, because it's just going to go for another... Hypnosis. It didn't land. Okay, thank god. Rain dance. You have Intimidate, not Swift Swim, unfortunately, but this thing should die now. And it missed, thank god. Oh my god, the bloody friendship getting rid of the poison. We needed that poison. We needed that poison. Steelix? Steelix? Should we have been setting up Dragon Dance instead? I don't know what to do. I don't- I'm not confident about one-shotting this. It did a lot of damage though. Thunderfang, this is gonna hurt. <laughs> oh my god, that actually would have killed. <sighs> okay, that actually would have killed, but the friendship. You're actually making up for it now. They made friendship so overpowered in Pokemon, man. Lopony. Actually, yes, I will. I am gonna switch. I am actually gonna switch. It has bounce, I've just thought. This Lopony definitely has bounce. But are we faster? Yes, we are. Okay, this thing's gone. This, this thing is gone. Okay, whatever comes out now, we do have the rain up, so it is weaker. I don't know what anything is going for, to be honest. Ah, the rain stopped, shit. Drift bloom. Oh, we can stay in Shadow Claw this. No, we can't. We need to switch. We need to switch. Yes, because you're normal type, which means ghost moves don't do anything. I don't know what moves it has. It probably has this. It probably has fucking hypnosis. It has the bloody dodgy team, doesn't he? He has the Diamond and Pearl team, I don't like that. They definitely could have fixed that. We have the Platinum Pokedex in this game, I don't see why we don't. he doesn't have his Platinum team. Will-O-Wisp? Wait. No way. You know how I said about burning Machamp? You know how I said about burning Machamp? We might actually be able to get it to burn the champ. And then we have guts activated constantly. Minimize, okay. I'm not. I'm sticking around. Burn me, please. Oh, it's up to evasiveness. Not good. Yeah, let's just waste a focus energy. We've got plenty of them to waste. Yes! You fool! <laughs> you fool! 
Thanks for the guts boost, bitch. <laughs> Come on. Baton pass. Or oh, whatever it's going into is going to have less evasion. That's annoying. Infernape. Level 61. And it missed. That's annoying. Right, this Infernape's going to be faster, but we but we have guts. We have to Earthquake. It has, it's gone for close combat. We miss. We're just gonna keep taking fire damage here. Come on. If we hit, it's definitely dead now. It's definitely dead now if we hit. Yes! It's gone. It has a focus sash. There's no way it actually has a focus sash. Oh my god, it just lived on one. No, it does have a focus sash. Damn. Okay. Um, close combat's gonna kill now, I think. So let's heal. And full restore. That's a bastard. We don't have them. What we do have is an earthquake. What? No! You... St no, you healed your guts, you fool. Stop. That's the one annoying thing about the bloody friendship. It heals the guts. Now this is going to do less damage. Thank God it's just, like, spamming close combat. Please land and just kill it. Thank you. Oh my god, you lost your guts, you idiot. We need- yeah, Mustache can finish this, no problem. Gyarados is definitely faster than a Drifblim. Will or Wisp? Ah, oh, bastard. We are bird now, so we are going to need to burn heal. And it's now a three hit kill. <sighs> okay, good. That's the one time it's good to heal burn. And it's just going to burn us again. I would like a crit, please. Ah, it's healing. Citrus berry? Yes. Minimize. Fuck. Ah, minimize is a bastard. I hate it. Oh, never mind. We literally won that battle just because of friendship, to be honest, I think. <laughs> there's... There's really nothing I can do about the friendship. It's kind of bullshit. But there's nothing I can do about it. I wish there was. Wait. Oh, wait. I'm um, using... Burn. I don't actually know who to use for um, 
the psychic gym. Not gym, the psychic, uh, psychic elite four. I think I'm tempted to go with the uh, mustache and dragon dance. Hello, Lucian. I would like to dragon dance you to oblivion. I'm being very, very risky in this elite four. You do use psychic types, and I have dark, dark Pokemon. But I think you have fairy types in your team as well. I think you have a Mr. Mime. There it is. Okay, Mr. Mime. What I don't fit. Part of me feels like Mr. Mime's special attack isn't too threatening. Intimidate is useless in this fight, by the way. So I say we Dragon Dance. We Dragon Dance and actually... Oh, it's going to set up screens, actually, isn't it? That's what it's going to do, set up screens. Yep, there's Reflect. Right. Dragon Dance 2. It's going to go for Light Screen now. Psychic, how much does this do? A scary amount, actually. Can we Rain Dance Waterfall and break through the Reflect? Psychic. We can take another Psychic. I think Psychic is one of its strongest moves. I'm gonna rain dance. It's gonna do another psychic. No, it goes for light screen. Okay, that's good. I don't know when the reflect wears off, but this is gonna do a lot of damage no matter what. It doesn't kill. And there's the second psychic. Okay. We got away with it going for light screen there. Do we need the waterfall for anything else? I don't think so. And then the full restore. Okay, the reflect might wear off next. Which is very good for the rest of the team. Because we are way faster. Okay. Okay. Does the reflect wear off yet? It, it, it must do, right? No. It doesn't. We stay in. I'm gonna heal. He sends in Giraffic, I'm going to heal. We did waste a bit of rain dance, but we only needed to take down the Mr. Mine. Because I don't think anything has, like, reflect or anything. And I don't think Giraffic is that. S strong of a Pokemon anyway. Trick room? No, you didn't. We're actually slow now. We're actually going to have to tank certain moves. We're actually going to have to be able to take certain moves now. I don't know what it's going for. Though. Thunderbolt? Okay, I think we just survived because of the friendship again. But yeah, definitely. Oh my god. That doesn't kill either. Oh, they re fucking reflect. I don't know what to do. There's nothing I really can do. Do we need mustache for that? We do. I think we need Mustache to stay in. We need to keep Mustache alive. He's going for a Thunderbolt. I don't know what can take Thunderbolt. Genuinely don't know what to do.
Who takes Thunderbolt the best? Amazingly, it's actually Spoon who takes Thunderbolt the best, but HP wise, you're weak. It's between 199, 114, 168, 145. I think Arbs takes it the best. <sighs> Fuck. I don't know what to do. Arbs is a fighting type. I think what we should do... I, I am thinking about Alakazam. And Dazzling Gleam. Oh god. See, if Bark was still alive, I would send him in immediately. Because he's grass type, he takes the... He takes the uh, Thunderbolt, no problem. That's twice Gyarados has survived because of friendship, by the way. <laughs> I think Arbs takes it the best. I really do. 133 special defense isn't even that good. It's a giraffe rig, though. And we are definitely slower than giraffe rig. I guess. Psychic? What the hell? How slow is giraffe rig? What? What? No, how slow is this giraffe rig? It's a giraffe. It's like a horse. It's like a horse thing. That's literally the slowest Pokemon we have. What the fuck? This quick attack still, this priority still work in, in Trick Room. Priority should still work in Trick Room, right? Well, quick attack even kill from here. Yes, it does still work. Kill it. Oh, fuck off. Twisted Dimensions return to normal. Yeah, cool. Just die and fuck off. My god. Metatron. We're faster than a Metatron. Do we kill though? I'm expecting a pure power high jump kick. It's neutral. Yep. Wow. Critical hit, are you kidding me? Look at the team. Look at the team. Wait. Oh yeah, because it didn't miss. I was going to say it didn't take recall because it didn't miss. That's why. If this doesn't kill, I... Oh, thank God, honestly. Thank God. Thank God that killed, man. I'm getting frustrated. We have three Pokemon to take on Cynthia, man. Three. He has his own Alakazam. I reckon... Oh, what if I Shadow Ball? 
I think we can take an Alakazam with an Alakazam. It's level 60. We're like 5 levels, 6 levels above it. What, what does it go for? Shadow Ball? You have decent special defense. It has nasty plot. Oh, that's terrifying from an Alakazam. Spoon. Please one shot it. Ah. Shit. What the fuck do we do? Because this Alakazam is just going to sweep us now. Why is it faster, by the way? Future Sight. Wait, Future Sight? Oh my god. Idiot. What's he doing? Crit, no, crit, no. Psychic, we take it, we take this. Yes! Yes! Get in. That's it, right? That's the last one. We have to swap. Yes, we have to swap because we're about to, we're about to take a future site. We're about to get hit with a future site. Ah, if only we had a dark Pokemon. Do we have... We have a max portion. We can use it. You kind of need to use it. We, Mustache might actually die here, you know. What's that going to do? <sighs> yes! Demon. Absolute demon. Use Trick Room all you want, mate. Use Trick Room all you want. Just means Payback doesn't work. Is Bronzong actually physical? Bronzong, sorry. Is Bronzong actually physical? It's not very effective. I genuinely think we lose to Cynthia, you know. I don't think we I don't think we can win this now. We have three Pokemon. I don't think we can win. We genuinely might just have to brute force Cynthia. There's not much we can do. Can we beat Cynthia? Yeah. Champion is far stronger than the Elite Four. I know that. But we are far stronger than when we first started this. Spoon. Can... There's no way Spoon is going to sweep Cynthia. There's no way. Spoon is by far the fastest thing. It by far outspeeds everything that Cynthia has. Oh god, the fucking piano. You can't hear it, but... Ladies and gentlemen.
Whatever happens, this is the last episode. And you know what? We managed to get to the champion. That Elite Four was horrible. Spiritomb. Okay, we can take Spiritomb. Spiritomb, what it's going to do straight away... I will say... This is not a good type matchup. But part of me thinks that it's going to be using special moves. That's what I would do, but it could definitely have Sucker Punch. I'm going to set up Calm Minds. This thing is actually quite bulky. I think it's defense and special defense of both 108. Dark Pulse, do we take it? Yes. But not very well. We needed to use something other than Dark Pulse. Come here. There's no way we can actually do it. That did over a hundred damage. Dark Pulse. Yes. That's good. That's really good. Because we just set up Calm Minds until Dark Pulse does no damage. And she goes for Sucker Punch. Okay, so she only has Dark Moves. She might have Shadow Ball. But Shadow Ball and Dark Pulse have the same power. Okay, she keeps going for Sucker Punch. Sucker Punch only has 5 PP. But it's very, very dangerous. I'm gonna keep setting up. Yeah, she keeps going for Sucker Punch. I'm gonna go I'm gonna go keep going for Calm Minds until she goes for another move. We actually might be able to get away with this, you know. This is the most powerful spoon has ever been. That's four? Is that three sucker punches or four? I'm not really counting. It doesn't matter now because whatever move she goes for, it's going to do nothing. Unless it's sucker punch. Yeah, it keeps going for sucker punch. I will, I will say I've just thought pressure. Do we have enough to take to take out our entire team? We might no, because we've only used three. Have we? How many car mines have we used? Is it just attacks? Okay, we've used all six now. Okay, there's the dark pulse. She's, she must have run out of Sucker Punches. Because she's using Dark Pulse now. Has she run out of Sucker Punches? Yes, she has. That thing is so dead. Oh my god. We might actually win. <laughs> we might actually win. Oh my god, we might actually win. Spoon, you genuinely might actually sweep. Does she have any priority moves? I'm trying to think. I'm trying to think, does she have any priority moves? What priority moves does she have? Bullet Punch? Because we are the fastest thing in our- We are faster than her entire team, and we're only going to get faster as we level up. It's, it's still the guard jump that I'm worried about. Right, Gastrodon. Do we just one-shot everything on our team? Is that how this works? Do we actually just one-shot everything on our team? No way. No way. No way. Spoon. Spoon is going to do a lot of damage anyway, but he's at maximum special attack now. I don't think anything can take, can take this. Oh my god, the Milotic is the one that I'm actually scared about because the Milotic is very tough. Very bulky.
No way, is this how the series ends? Oh my god, that's four. That's four down, we only have two left. I, I think it's either the Lucario or the Togekiss, and then the Garchomp. It's the Lucario. All this time I was worried about her Togekiss. She doesn't even have it. Bullet Punch? No, it doesn't have Bullet Punch. Oh my god, I think we just beat Cynthia. <laughs> I think we just... I think we just swept Cynthia. No, where did we just sweep Cynthia? I... I can't believe this. Alakazam is faster than a Garchomp, surely. Earthquake, no. Oh, no way! No way! We just won. Those last two Elite Four members were the hardest fights we've ever had. And then Cynthia. We got lucky twice. I feel like we should have lost... I feel like we should have lost this twice, but the fucking friendship. It's just silent. It, we just won. Admittedly, it wasn't kind of a bullshit way, but we just won. I, after the last two, after the last two League Four members, I didn't think we had a chance. Then it missed a dark pulse, she started spamming Sucker Punch. That Garchomp Earthquake, I'm surprised I'm surprised that, that Garchomp I was bed, to be honest. They they must be like fully EV trained. Because that that Garchomp is surprisingly fast. Honestly, I can't remember, does Spoon actually have a speed law in nature? I can't remember. This is really creepy that it's just completely silent. All I can hear is just a little ding. Every time the little arrow shows up. I am shocked that we beat this first try. I'm shocked that we beat this at all. We shouldn't have won, but we did. There's literally, that's literally the definition of power of friendship, man. Like, friendship is so overpowered. And we actually, we just, we got away with that. We should not have won. I can't believe we actually won that. Oh my god. We actually won. That Ultra Ball. Half the team died. I expected... I expected the Elite Four to be smooth sailing. Or smoother than that, at least. Died very early. I got very frustrated and reckless during against that giraffe rig. Nuzlocke completed. 
The little mute thing on my telly is getting in the way. Did I just time that perfectly? Oh my god. <sighs> well, not the ending I was expecting, not particular, not honestly the ending that I wanted, but we won. We actually beat the Nuzlocke. Again, as I said, those past, those last two uh, Elite Four members, I genuinely didn't expect to beat them. And I actually expected this to be a lot long, to be, I, ex I actually expected this episode to be a lot longer. <laughs> Aaron was a breeze. Bertha took out one of our Pokemon. Flint, did Flint take out any of our Pokemon? I don't think so. I don't think so, but Flint was a bastard. Flint was an arsehole. Absolute pain to deal with. <laughs> Do you want to know a fun fact? This is only the second time that I've beaten the Sinnoh Elite Four. The second. That Elite Four was really hard. I, I feel like the only reason we won that, and the only reason Gyarados is still alive, is because of friendship. So, I think I know it doesn't really make sense, but I think the way... I think the message that this video is... Um, use use friendship Pokemon and you will win pretty much any fight. Yeah. You, if you use Pokemon that, you, that need friendship... Uh, you will win pretty much every fight. Just don't use guts. But, yeah. Thank you for watching. The, that, not just this, this episode, but the series. The series has done surprisingly well. Uh, there are a few videos, as of recording this, that still don't have any views. But for someone who hardly even exists on YouTube... Especially the last video did actually all right. But I feel like I probably should have grinded more. Should have grinded a little bit more. But we won. Beak did fuck all other than die. I mean, he took out the giraffe rig and that's probably... Now that I think about it, Big probably made the biggest contribution to the team by taking all that giraffe rig. Other than that, I didn't really do anything. Intimidate, the double intimidate strat didn't actually come into play, I don't think. I think it did at one point, but I don't think it actually came into play. Uh, we tried the rain dance, dragon dance strategy. That worked, actually. But I think the I think the strategy that I had in mind that worked the most, actually more than I expected, was the Spoon Carmine strategy. Ha we literally just swept Cynthia with a max special attack, Alakazam. And the only thing that could have killed it, obviously, the, Gar the Garchomp. And that's why I'm thinking I probably should have grinded more if I was a high level, would have outsped. Holy crap. Well, thank you for watching. I will see you in the next series. I will see you for Legends Arceus.